Hi everyone, welcome back to Bombshell Beauty. My name is Yolanda and this is day number six of my Christmas vlog. Um, well, or Christmas videos actually, because I'm not really vlogging much. Um, so I'm just, I guess I'll just title them as I post them and do them. Um, I hope my music's not too loud. I decided to go with country Christmas music today. Um, so I hope it's not too loud. I guess some songs maybe, but I'll just turn it down. So I'm going to do today's video, or a mixture of some video, of my Lush haul. Um, I posted today, December 6th, um, yesterday's video of my Lush experience. <laughs> um, I went, I had to go on the UK website because they had the list of everything. I went on the US website, I mean you would figure it would have the same stuff on there and they, theirs is set up different so I couldn't find the stuff that I bought at all. So I went on the UK site and found the stuff that I bought, wrote on my bags. Um, there's just one that I bought that I don't know what the name is and I couldn't find it on either site so I don't know. But I remember it's a coconut and vanilla something. <laughs> so I'll show that in a minute. And another thing that confused me was this bag here. My sister um, gave me two bath bombs that a friend of hers makes her own bath bombs, homemade ones, and they're they're so beautiful that I thought it was one of my lush ones. And it was this cupcake one, and it smells like um, coconut. This one smells good, and it's so pretty. I don't even know if I'm gonna use it, just because it. You hate to melt pretty things like that, even like the soaps and stuff. And then there was this one, and I feel so stupid because I was on the Lush website looking everywhere for the Silver Star. And I saw a Silver Star, but I was like, mine looks like it's in foil. I'm like, why can't I find it? And it's wrapped in, in the foil, and I can't find one wrapped in foil. And it was another one that my sister had given me that her friend made. It's just written in full, but it's a star, and it's crumbling a little bit, but <laughs> you can see how it was easy, easy for me to think it was from Lush. I mean, it's perfect. So thank you to my sister for those. So there, go, there was my one thing that I figured out for myself that this is not from Lush. <laughs> so now we'll get on to my Lush. Um, I wrote down the ingredients and what they do, really. So we'll start with my shampoo bar. And it looks like this. And it's got a little, um, I'm not sure what, what flower this is. <clears throat> but it has, it's called Karma Comba. And it's got lemongrass, sweet orange, lavendin, pine, and patchouli to scent. Um, it has LME oil, which bounces the scalp and keeps it clean and clear. And it just smells so good. And I just hope that it doesn't dry, make my hair dry looking. And this is the one I bought before. Um, so I guess we'll see, but I had red or like black hair back then, so it's probably going to be different on bleached hair, but if it's not, I'll just try another one next time. It smells so good, but it does make my sinuses hurt. <laughs> okay, so the next one is a bath bomb, and it is called Sex Bomb. And every time I hear that word, I think of Tom Jones. And it looks like this. It's a big one. And it's got the little rose in the middle. And it is, it turns the water pink and the rose floats around in your bath, just bobbling around. And it's got jasmine, yang, yang, yangling, <laughs> ylang, ylang. I can't ever pronounce that right. So stop laughing at me. 
and then it's got clary sage and it doesn't smell that strong right now it just smells like you, that bubble bath smell so it's so yummy and I forgot to bring a drink in here again because when I was going through these and writing the names down and writing on my little Marilyn Monroe tablet I started getting that itch in my throat and coughing and choking and I was just like great I'm gonna be doing my video and the scents are gonna choke me so the next one is called Christmas Sweater and it's one of their Christmas bath bombs and it is um, a spicy scent and it's pink with the two reindeer on the front and it's I hate when the ads go on your I have a YouTube video of the Christmas songs and you know how YouTube is they gotta put an ad on everything um, it's got Sicilian lemon oil, mustard, and ginger powders, and it is it eases the muscles. The coriander seed and clove bud oils are in there. And I can smell the coriander and the clove a lot. The ginger's in there, but I smell mostly the clove and the coriander, which this one's going to be nice. And... Oh, it's so dusty. <laughs> they may have had the stickers with the, the bags, because each um, display has the bags there, and I'm thinking maybe the stickers were next to the bags, and I just didn't see them because it was just so many people and stuff and I was just trying to get out of everyone's way okay and then we have one more and this is the one I don't know which one it is it was under the um, butter bear uh, bath bombs and it looks like almond and um, vanilla and coconut I think and it, I can smell the almond And the vanilla so it's one that's something like that um, but I just I just don't know which one it's called um, and for the butter bear I've just went ahead and wrote down um, what the butter bear had and it was vanilla cocoa powder and ylang ylang <laughs> um, so that is all my lush bath bombs and Let's see. I thought I had written something else down. I'm going to call my sister later and ask her about that other butter bear because I swear I had two. And I could have sworn I put one back and kept one for her. And then I bought that one that doesn't have a name as what I put in place of the other butter bear. And I'm like, or did I have it in my basket and don't remember putting it on the counter? I don't, I just don't know. But she charged me for two and I only got one. Oh, no, it says Butter Bear Bath Bomb 2. So it must be like there's two different kinds, I think. Because it shows quantity one. I don't know. I can't read my receipt. <laughs> So that's my little haul from Lush. I'm going to continue this video a little bit later. Um, I haven't done my tree yet. I think I'm going to go ahead and do that when my son gets home. I told him he can help me. And then later on I'm going to paint my nails. I'm going to just, I decided to go with Mingle with Kringle. It's just a gold shimmery frosty polish. So I will see you in a little while. Uh, got the Christmas mess out. The new tree under here. I gotta open it. <laughs> and move the cat tower. So before I open all that mess, I'm gonna open my advent calendar for today because I forgot. 
where's number six? I forgot to get the makeup one at work today, so I have to do it tomorrow. Can't open it. <laughs> Santa, and here comes Sasha to be nosy. Okay, this is good. Let's Say hi, Sasha. No woman will get the Sasha, Sasha. If you come to be nosy, you're gonna, you know what I'm getting ready to do. That's why the tree goes up, and you guys are gonna act up. And Jetta's over here. Garden her bone with her life, and here comes Zora. Are you coming to be nosy too? You can't have that. They're like boxes for me to play in. And Pepper's on. We call it the Pepper Castle. Because she goes up there and sits, and we gotta bring the cat treats to her up there and everything. And there's my hubby's base and his stack of speakers and everything so i'm gonna get started on my tree so these are the directions to my tree look at that nice rust spot in the middle of the paper that looks nice it looks like chocolate or something gross and i'm looking at the lady putting this tree together and i just started laughing <laughs> And I'm like, what in the world? It's a little bit different than the one that I had. So hopefully I'm not going to have too much of a problem, but I'm concerned with these. This is the stand. And it just... I think it's metal. I just... It feels really light. I just hope it's not going to topple over really easy if the cats decide to jump in it. Yes, I'm doing something right now. Yes, you, and you're going to lay on my paper. Really? And then there's Pepper. Look at... Uh, this is the life of a cat mom. They are the nosiest. And Pepper, the one that's in the box right now... We call her Professor Pepper because she's always inspecting things like she's trying to learn. Hey, get out. Don't chew it. Hey! So I'm going to put it together. I don't think I'm going to decorate it tonight because I think I bought lights last year, but I can't remember and I didn't see them. So I might wait to decorate tomorrow and get some lights. I mean, it comes with lights already on it, but I want some extra lights. <laughs> Um, so, let's see how this goes. So, that's my tree undecorated with a cat sticking her cat butt out. They're ready to... It still looks a little bit wonky because I still got to fluff some more branches, but this is it. I can't reach the top one on the very top. It's crooked. But I'm going to decorate it tomorrow and hopefully it'll look better. <laughs> so I'm going to sign off tonight and do my nails. See you guys tomorrow.